Here's a brand new Canva hack you're gonna love. Oh my gosh, did you know you could code inside of Canva? For an example, I created this in seconds. This is an interactive social media pricing package. You can do this too, so let me show you how. First, open Canva and then you're gonna click on Canva AI. Once you do that, you will have an option called code for me. So you're going to click on code for me. And then this is where you simply type in your prompt and click submit. And then Canva will automatically code for you. They also give you a ton of different things that you could do with Canva code, but I went ahead and wrote my prompt and I'm going to share that with you. So if you want to recreate this to test things out, you can copy my prompt. So either screenshot this or save this video for later. You can also customize this with your brand colors and also add a destination URL. So I just went ahead and copy pasted that example prompt. And then now I'm going to go ahead and click the purple arrow to submit this prompt. And it would only take a few seconds and then Canva will do its magic and it will open a tab on the right hand side and you can see it's like writing its code. So give it a few seconds and Canva AI will finish that code up for you. So once it's complete, you will see the end results. It's not going to be all gibberish here. It's going to actually give you what it created. So this is what it created for me using my example prompt. And I think it did a really excellent job. You can see it's interactive. Things are changing. And this is just the first iteration of this. You can go back and make other changes if you like, but I'm happy. So now I'm going to click use in design. Now you can use this in a website, presentation, doc, or whiteboard. I'm going to click website and now when you click on preview, you can see it's fully interactive. When I toggle, it's all working. And the best part is when I click on mobile view, it's already mobile optimized. Now I asked Canva AI to change the color. I gave the hex codes and also I asked it to change the destination URL so that it goes to, for an example, my TikTok profile when they click get started now. This is going to be helpful if you want them to land on a different page or a website once they click get started now, like for an example, your checkout page. And now when I click this, it should go to my TikTok and there you go. It did that. Perfect. And now you can add that page to your portfolio website. So this is the Canva website we created together on a previous tutorial. So if you missed that tutorial, let me know in the comments and then I will send it to you. And no, you don't need to learn how to code to create designs like this. And there are so many different tools like Canva that make it possible. So now I added that section that we created with Canva code to my portfolio section and you can see it's fully interactive and I also added that to my navigation menu. And don't worry, I show you how to do that in my longer Canva tutorial. I hope this was helpful. Let me know if you will try this inside of Canva.